Hey, what's going on, everybody? <clears throat> Woo. Yeah, it's been uh, another interesting day. It is day 14 on this manifestation journey. Um, so I, I, I think I sneezed. Whenever I sneeze, I tend to get a bit of laryngitis. Um, so forgive me if I'm speaking uh, softly. Anyhow, it's Sunday. Oh. Gear shift went out of gear. Um, so, yeah, I haven't been feeling that hot today. Haven't been feeling that hot. Kind of sluggish. Not sure why. Um, I know I did not have a smoothie today, which is a typical part of my diet daily. So that might be part of it. Um, low energy, I don't know. But day 14, two weeks into the consecration diet, uh, eating in accordance with my blood type, which is all positive. And um, yeah, just, I don't know, it's very, it's very sunny out. It's 57 degrees, which is great weather. But this is actually my first time stepping out. So that might be the problem as well. I mean, you know, last week, Sunday, I actually um, went down to the lakefront and absorbed the sun and, you know, felt great. Uh, this time I spent most of the day indoors um, doing some necessary cleaning, um, yeah, and uh, some purging. So, yeah, that's what it's been. It's uh, 3.36 p.m. Central Standard Time. And uh, I was going to meet a friend out for his birthday for just a little while. Uh, obviously, I have to be up early in about 12 hours. In fact, I'll have to be up. And so I won't be long. But really nothing really to, to report. Um, I, I was listening to um, some self-help meditation types uh, YouTube videos earlier. Um, but honestly, I really just haven't been on today as far as uh, meditation, as far as, uh, you know, delving deep into things. I don't know if it's sometimes, you know, you just need a break, even a break from a break every once in a while. Uh, maybe, you know, you become so focused, you become burnt out with that focus uh, that may be that may be I've heard it said that too much of anything is not good for you right so even too much of a good thing so I guess we just got to keep everything in perspective in proper context and not to be again extreme either to the upside or downside. We should be pursuing after equilibrium, recognizing that we need both the negative and the positive. So there were several situations that I would categorize as uh, negative now, when I say negative, that does not or should not infer that I mean likewise bad. In the conventional uh, meaning or sense of the, word, the term that we use today, bad, like the opposite of good, that's not what I mean when I say, when I'm t uh, referring to negative. Negative is merely <clears throat> something uh, or someone that takes away okay in more of a mathematical sense 
we know that negative is when when something is subtracted from something um, and it's a draw I should, you know maybe that's a better way to look at it. it's a draw on uh, on you or on a situation okay it's the opposite of addition or adding adding to yourself it's taken away okay so we need both we don't want to be over positive um, it's unnecessary either you're positive or you're not right so it's unnecessary to be over positive it's a bit of a, a redundancy so that's not what we want to or should aspire to uh, be so who knows maybe I'm at equilibrium <laughs> maybe it's just foreign to me to be to, you know not to be drained but also not to be uh, exuberant or rambunctious or ambitious or really ambitious you know maybe I'm at that I'm maybe I'm in an in between equal at an uh, in between equilibrium who knows who knows you know sometimes when you you've been subjected to an abnormal situation for so long uh, normal does not feel normal because your norm would be uh, subjection to abnormal that would become your norm that's all you come to have come to know right so what is normal now so I don't know <sighs> I kind of don't like saying that all the time I don't know I don't know we just become all this stuff is habitual. It's a, a creatures of habit. Uh, another one, you know, good morning. You know, is there really a good morning when someone passes away? Is uh, the condition of being in mourning, right? You suffer, you suffer a loss. You're mourning that loss. So I don't know why we say good morning. Or hello, you know, like hell is low, and you know, who thought of that? <laughs> who thought? Who thought of that term? But, uh, anyways, I digress. I'm just rambling and ranting, but I did want to check in. Um, I didn't feel like it. I was like, ah, I'll just wait. <laughs> uh, but I really do appreciate you if you're, you've been along on this journey with me. Um, we're not, we're not stopping. Uh, in fact, we're going to put the pedal down just a little bit further. Um, still going to have these, you know, some ups and downs until we get that normalization, that equilibrium figured out. Um, I still, you know, stub my toe. I still, you know, make mistakes and all that kind of stuff. That's part of the human condition. Uh, but what we are aspiring uh, to obtain and accomplish is a healthy equilibrium and to demonstrate and prove that true power comes from within and not without, okay? And we're gonna do that by, through experimentations, okay? We're going to do that by manifesting uh, things that we pursue after, you know? after employing the six steps you know plus other 
things that I I have researched and studied and have uh, heard other people teach and instruct on, you know, we're going to apply those things. All right, so that's where we're at. You know, you have to forgive me. I'm I'm in a little bit of a I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Maybe I won't label it anything. I'll just deal with it. But we're going to get through it. And we're going to march on into the morrow. You know, in positivity, well-grounded, and ready to conquer another day. And make, an, make the, the day the best day yet. All right, so hopefully you're along with us again for the ride. And we would love to hear your feedback, your comments, your suggestions. All right, feel free to do so in the comment section of either of the videos. I do pay attention to all comments. I do respond to all comments. So you will not have wasted your time through your communication. It is much appreciated. All right, so we'll see you on the next upload. And peace to you.